Okay guys, Akumaldo Crypto here with another Bitcoin update. So, <clears throat> what a nice price action we had. Huh? Uh, so, I, I don't know how to count this other rate than this, A, B, C. Considering this whole structure here as a corrective structure, okay, to put in this wave through here which is gonna make us go down okay uh this is the weekly chart by the way we try to touch the this 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 green line here is the eight ema okay and you see the 55 ema is crossing now the ema is now it's a it's a bearish sign now but now um, for the first time ever for the first time ever, this orange line here, which is the EMA 13, has crossed. Uh, actually, the 55 EMA crossed it. So the 55 EMA is now above the 13 and the 8 EMA. Um, this is a bearish sign, guys. Even though we are going up, okay, that's uh, another piece of information that's here to giving us that... To, to, to make us pay attention okay now we have here the 21 EMA about to cross I don't know next week about to cross and stay below the, the 55 EMA this red one here this yes this is a, a, a nice piece of information isn't it then we will, we will have this cross here then it's gonna be a, a bearish scenario indeed okay so let's take a look at the daily chart. Daily chart is almost the same thing that we have been discussing. Uh, uh, we are going up. We have retraced enough. Okay, we have retraced enough. Here you have the Fibonacci retracement from the top of this wave A here to the bottom. Here we have retraced what? 50%, which is, uh, which is fine. So if we finish it here, it's gonna be okay. I, I won't be I won't be surprised at all. I won't I will I won't be I won't be caught I won't be caught off guard. So I'm prepared for this. But I think that we're gonna have one more leg up. Okay, one more leg up to finish this way A B C. To finish this A this wave two here. So this whole structure here, guys. A, B, this whole structure here is correcting this uh, this this stunning drop here that we had. Remember, this was a, 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 a huge, look at this bearish candle here, guys. This was a, a, a crazy day, don't you remember? Uh, those two days, by the way, right? Here we had a reaction upon touching this blue line, but this one was nasty. So... This is correcting this whole structure here. So this is uh, a structure that is in, that, that, that is corrective in nature. Okay, it's corrective. So this is what we have. A, B, C. This is the the zooming this thing. Okay, uh, this is A, B, C. This is the, the second wave. The same second wave that we had here. Oops. That, nope, so almost. Uh, that we have here. Okay, same second wave. Uh, so now what we have, we tried to break this 100% yesterday. Tried like one, two, three, four, five, six times. We, we broke it and we got to this minus 38, 20% algo target, but then we we just dropped. Okay, it was, <laughs> that was clear that it would happen. Okay, so then this is, this I would, uh, yesterday I called this, I, I think I posted on my Twitter that this was the end of the third wave. Yes, I said this, but then I had this another high here, I just changed it, because sometimes that's it. I saw that it was struggling to break it, so I said, no way it's gonna break, but then it broke, but it was a momentary, just a momentary... Uh, breach then it went down again okay this is what we are gonna call wave four it has retraced 38 20 percent 
it might be it might be it and it might go up okay be prepared because it's not necessarily uh, a, a rule that it's gonna get to the 50 percent okay and it's not a, a rule that's gonna stop here and it's not gonna go lower okay we have here the median line so you might uh, make the case that we are gonna do something like this I don't know uh, and touch the median line here yes okay not a problem at all we might not have not have finished this a wave here and I don't think we have we might have we might touch this resistance here okay and we would pull back a little bit up and then we would finish at the 50 percent or we might have a triangle okay it's don't we don't have data enough to tell we don't but I think that we might get as low as 65,000 um, sorry 6500 okay or um, or 6600 that would be enough and then it would go up again another leg it, here we have um, at the top of this well, I have those two targets here right is this is we have a lot of confluence 127 20 percent minus 618 minus uh, this this is 38 20 percent of the whole movement okay another resistance here we have this historical resistance it, this is the red box here that I'm marking here and we have the 618 65 percent together with the minus 33 60 percent of this retracement here guys so a lot of uh, a lot of red flags showing uh telling us oh hey here we have a target guys here we have a target perhaps crossing this uh six one eight six five percent of the pitchfork here okay perhaps it's we don't have data to to really tell what's gonna where it's gonna stop if this thing goes up okay those are the targets okay we have this the sweet spot for a wave two here but don't forget though that Bitcoin has proved to to get to the 786 here we would have the 786 that would mean what uh, 7,000 right 7 7100 7100 okay so we might get to a, a higher target touch this yellow line here who knows okay if we have a really bullish momentum I don't think so okay this was my first target 50% done so then I would start stocking some uh, I'm, I'm start laddering my shorts now okay that's what I'm doing and taking taking my profit whenever is necessary whenever I think it's gonna be uh, another place to refill my position so uh, that, that that's it guys I think that's enough for the weekend Okay, I think that's uh, we might have a, a, a huge dump here that perhaps crossed the 50%. Okay, so where is the stop loss? Pretty simple, guys. Pretty simple. The stop loss is here, guys, at the top of this wave one here. Okay, this is my stop loss. Here is uh, if we get to the six six five thousand. I'm sorry, <laughs> like 65,000 is impossible. <laughs> Not now, at least. 6,500, this is our stop loss, okay? It's, it's not impossible to get here, by the way, because this, this is a diagonal, but it doesn't look like it, okay? Uh, if it's a diagonal way for uh, go and uh, retrace to the region of wave one, but I don't, I don't think the shape is a, it's okay, but so... Nevertheless, I would put at here seven six four hundred. Okay, I stop loss. That, that's not actually a stop loss because if you are like me shorting, it's not a stop loss. It's just a confirmation of your position. Okay, it's just taking profit. Okay, I'm not I'm not longing. I am not going against the trend. I am for the trend, so I am shorting. So. If you want to stop loss, if you are going up, if you if you are long, if you want to take this trade, which I don't recommend, 
only if you are a scalper, if you are really aware what's going on, and if you are looking all the time. So this would be like the stop loss, 6,400, okay? Um, what is nice is that we have indeed no market acceptance here, guys, you can see? Perhaps if we go to this region here where we have this resistance, it's, it, it, this won't act as a resistance at all. It's gonna be just bridge through it and get to this region here where we have some acceptance. So bear in mind that, okay? Um, that's it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you like my video, my content, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't followed me on social media, on Twitter, please consider doing so. And join our server, uh, Crypto Trader Educational Institute. You have the link in the description, okay? And thank you very much again. I hope you guys enjoy your weekend. I'm gonna have a wonderful weekend. And you guys, of course, you're gonna have one as well. Cheers. Bye-bye.